Young one, you're probably thinking a lot of things right now from that video, and that's fine. I'm here to tell you the truth on how these people operate, how these demonic, evil people operate. See, they reached out to you to turn you against me. They lied to your face, and you're believing it. You know, it's sad. How quick you are to believe a lie of a stranger over the truth of your own son. You might not think that they're playing you. You might not think that they're using you, Gordon, but these people that you're talking to, they are very much using you. They are. They want to use you to destroy me and to destroy my family. And I'm not going to let that happen. That's not going to happen. So, Gordon, I'm telling you. As the only person that's being fucking honest with you. Stop listening to these fucking people and get the fuck off of YouTube. Because getting off of YouTube and ignoring these people, that's the only way you're going to be able to keep from being used and attacked. You want to know what happened to every single person that has stood up for me and defended me against these evil people? They're gone. Every one of them have been bullied to the point to where they are so scared to even say anything anymore. Because of people like N-Word Boy that have actually scared them to the point to where they don't know what to do anymore. They don't know what to do anymore. Because they're so scared. Because of what these trolls do. So trust me when I say Gordon. These trolls that you're befriending. They're not. In any way. Shape or form. Your friend. That night on Marty's panel. That's what I was trying to tell you. Marty is a lying snake. Kate, William Gordon, they're all lying pieces of shit. And Kate is the biggest one of all. She really is. And you're believing it like a fool. I'm trying to tell you, Gordon, these people, they ain't your friends. These people are very evil. They're destructive. They don't want to see me do good. They want to keep me locked in a bubble and make me do whatever they want, want me to do. And I'm not doing it. They want to try to force me to do shit that I don't want to do. And because I'm not doing what they want, look at what they've done to me. Look at what they've done to my family, my friends, the people I care about. The people that want to stand up for me are now so afraid to stand up for me because of these people, man. Hey, right, come on, Gordon, wake the fuck up. I know you're not dumb. I know you're not stupid. You're smart. So my question is, why ain't you using your head and realizing... What these people are doing is fucking wrong. Illegal entrapment. Slander. Defamation of character. Harassment. Cyberbullying. Gang stalking. Cyber stalking. Attempted murder. Assault and battery. Take your pick. 
Not to mention breaking and entering. Attempted Grand Theft Auto. Three different times. Vandalizing our vehicle and our house. Theft multiple times. And that's just a handful of things that they've done. To our house, to me, to mom, to our family. So take your fucking pick, Gordon. Are you really going to side with these fucking evil ass monsters? Are you really going to side with these evil people? Or are you going to listen to the one person that's telling the fucking truth? And being fucking honest with you, which is me. They're doing all this because I won't do what they want to do, which is rage out and get mad. That's why they're doing this. And yeah, I may have made my fair share of mistakes. And that's true. I admit that I made my fair share of mistakes. But at least I'm not sitting over here on the internet like these people are. And bullying people. And attacking. And harassing. That's what these people do. I don't. Their words don't match my current actions. Those are my old actions. Not my new ones. Fuck my old ones. Pay attention to my new actions. What I'm doing now currently. Because there seems to be one lesson that you still have not learned yet, Gordon, and that's sad. And this is a lesson you should have learned long ago, even as a kid. Don't judge a man by his past, but by his current actions. And what he is currently doing. Like I said, we all have a past. We all have some sort of past. It is what it is. But judge me not by my past, but by what I am doing currently. You know what I do every day? And have been doing every day? For the past several months? Gaming out, live streaming, and working on fucking music. And hanging out with my friends and family. That's it. Now if I'm doing that. How could I supposedly be over here. Doing all this other shit that I'm not doing. Wake up Gordon. These people are lying to your face. And like I told the last troll that messaged me. Their end is near. I will expose them for the lying pieces of shit that they are. And when that day does come, that's going to be a good day. And the only thing that I ask of you when that day does come and I expose these people just like I exposed Kate on my kick stream the other night. When I do expose these people for the pieces of shit that they really are. When I do expose them. All I ask is that you apologize to me for everything that you've said. That's all I ask. I, mean, I really wish you would listen to me now. So that you wouldn't have to worry about an apology later on. But it's pretty clear to me that you don't want to listen. And like I said, that's on you. Like I said before, I don't hate you. 
I hate your actions and what you're doing. And you got one thing wrong, Gordon. I don't hate rules. If anything, I love rules. But what I don't like are cyber bullies like these people. And I'm sorry, but when you're doing what these people are doing, all rules go out the window. There are no rules when this shit starts going down. The only rule I have asked them to follow is this. If they have a problem with me, take it up with me and leave my friends and my family out of it. That's all I have ever asked of them, but they can't even do that. The only time I've ever brought friends and family into the fight is if they've started it. Or if their friends and family are actually helping to enable what they're doing. That's the only time. But other than that, I have not done anything like what they're doing to me. Wake up, Gordon. These people ain't your friends. They are not your friends. And I wish you would fucking see that, man. Well, like I said, Gordon, you're going to say what you're going to say and do what you're going to do. That's on you. You can, like I said in the last video, you can continue to lie to these people all you want. But you and I both know deep down that I'm right about everything I say. And like I said, you can't blow holes in the truth, Gordon. You can't do it. You can lie to everybody else, but there's two people you can't lie to. Yourself and God. So... You can continue down this path of lies and continue to lie to yourself and find out the truth later on. Or you can listen to what I'm saying and take what I'm saying seriously and actually start looking, looking into these people. And if you would like the article on Kate and the shit she's done, I will gladly, gladly send it to you. Just tell me your email or reach out to me on Facebook. Hell, I'll even send you the article on Facebook showing the evil kind of person that she really is. Choice is yours, Gordon. Like I said, I don't hate you. I harbor no hatred towards you. I just hate the things that you're doing. That's it. So... If you want to change all this, Gordon, let me know. I'll be happy to help. If you want to get away from these evil-ass people, let me know. I'll be glad to help. Because I know how these motherfuckers operate. You don't. I do. I've been around them long enough, and I know their every move before they fucking make it. Because I got it like that. I got people that watch their every fucking move. And every single thing that they do. So I know every plan. Every little thing. That they plan to do. Every little move they make. I got that shit unlocked. So Gordon like I said. It's your call man. Pick wisely.